हेलो एवरीवन आइए मनीषुर रहमान होप यू ऑल आर गुड गाइस टुडे आई वॉन्ट रिव्यू अबाउट द मोस्ट कॉमन ड्रग इन एन फिजियोलॉजी कॉल्ड एफाक्यूरम एंड एट्राक्यूरम सो गाइस इफ यू नॉट सब्सक्राइब आवर चैनल मेडिसिन विथ अनीस काइंडली सब्सक्राइब इट एंड क्लिक ऑन बेल आइकॉन फॉर आवर मोर रिव्यूज एंड अबाउट मेडिसन सो बेसिकली एफाक्यूरम एंड एट्राक्यूरम इज अ मसल रिलेक्जेंट In muscle relaxants, there are two types of muscle relaxants. Uh, one are depolarizing agent and uh, other non-depolarizing agent. So, atracurum and afacurum included a non-depolarizing agent. So, muscle relaxant we need for surgery, we need in ICU, and we need in emergency. If we have to paralyze, if you want to intubate the patient, if you want to put the ATT in trachea. we have to paralyze the muscles which control the vocal cords which controls the breathing so there are the skeletal uh, and there are the three types of muscles in our body cardiac muscles smooth muscles and skeletal muscles so these drugs like atracurum and afacurum are paralyze the skeletal muscles so during surgery the paralyze is very important part in anesthesia with unconsciousness and the pain management so afacurum is non depolarizing muscle relaxant the mechanism of afacurum and atracurum is we give it in iv at the neuromuscular junction and block the acetylcholine receptor it is the competitive blocker of acetylcholine receptor when the acetylcholine block there is no neuromuscular trans- transaction in muscles become paralyzed the dose of afacurum and atracurum is uh, 0.5 mg per kg induction dose when we induct uh, when we intubate the patient we give 0.5 mg per kg per kg uh, of afacurum and atracurum for induction and there are the maintenance dose maintenance dose of uh, uh, afacurum and atracurum is 0.2 mg per kg for maintenance of paralysis when the surgery finish we want to reverse the patient the wait for the duration of afacurum and atacurum and uh, the <clears throat> and then we give the reversal composition of neostagmine and glycopyrrolate neostagmine is the anticholinous the increase the acetylcholinic which can compete with atacurum to facilitate the neuromuscular transmission and then and then patient become unparalyzed breathe and the patient awake so this is all about this one drug the most common drug in anesthesiology this afacurum or atracurum is the most commonly used here in pakistan in other countries the atracurum is abolished and uh, abolished and cisatracurum roquinum replaced the atracurum reason is that the atracurum release histamine the patient is allergic and the patient is become hypertension and bronchon spasm so these are the side effects regarding metabolism of atracurum is the spontaneously metabolized in our body we called it hopman degradation while the 10% extra facilitated in the kidney and atracurum is safe in the renal failure and liver failure so guys it's a short review about afacurum and atracurum we hope you will understand if you like our video kindly subscribe our channel and click on bell icon thanks for watching